And this month's making a difference, 228 trees illuminated with 200,000 lights can be seen on University Avenue near UW Hospital in Madison. The display returned for another season thanks to a son determined to carry on the tradition his dad started nearly a quarter of a century ago. NBC 15's John Stofflett has the story for us. When I was coming down University Avenue here, for the very first time I saw it, I got it. I understood it. It was beautiful. It was something really, really special. I got that feeling. So my dad was a smart man. He had a, he had a great idea. The late Dr. Jack Cammer's idea? Create something so bright, so festive. They can't miss it. They're forced to look at it. In 1993, Dr. Jack Cammer decided to spruce up the 228 evergreens behind his office along University Avenue with tens of thousands of lights. We were the, really the first one to bring this kind of LED lights into Madison and uh, start a trend. When Jack died in 2010... In Madison, everybody knew him as the guy that started the lights because they love the lights. It's so, it's so endearing to everybody in town. Whatever it is they celebrate, my father wanted these lights to be for that. So it was for all religions, all faiths, um, those with no faith. Just here is a gift for you to enjoy, and uh, it's from my father. Just get them all on like so. Thanks to son Chris. Now I need a plug here to put this into. Jack's legacy of lights shines on. I've been keeping a watchful eye on him all these years as well. I know that I really want to keep his great idea going. That's, that's what sons do, I guess. <laughs> keep going. Keep going. Early each November, volunteers gather to help Chris string the lights. Oh, you know what? We got to untangle these. This year, a record 120 showed up. He'd be doing a backflip in heaven, seeing 120 people out here putting up his lights. Why the strong support? For thousands driving home after a long day or walking by, the lights just lift their spirits. Very often, people will be strolling up and down the parking lot here, looking at the lights. They drive in regularly, park their car, and just enjoy it. They jump out, they take pictures by the lights. That warms my heart. I know that's that, that everybody's sharing in the joy of the holiday lights. Sometimes you can make a difference just by making your corner of the world a little brighter. Something so incredible that is so impactful to people's lives, you have to keep it going. It's so fun, and, and some people, it's the actual start of their holidays. They know the holidays are here when they see the lights, and it brings them a smile. You want to keep that gift giving, and you know, if, if I can do that for my father, I will do that for as long as I possibly can. Wonderful story. That, that was John Stofflett reporting. You can help keep the lights on by making a donation. We put a link where you can contribute under news links at NBC15.com. Now, if you'd like to nominate someone for NBC15's Making a Difference Award, just go to the homepage at NBC15.com and click on the Making a Difference logo.